The nervous system does that through three main nodes of control. Basically, we have upper motor neurons in our motor cortex. So those are in our in our skull. And those are involved in deliberate movement. Those upper motor neurons send signals down to my spinal cord where there are two categories of neurons. One are the lower motor neurons. And those lower motor neurons send little wires that we call axons out to our muscles and cause those muscles to contract. They do that by dumping chemicals onto the muscle. In fact, the chemical is acetylcholine. Now, there's another category of neurons in the spinal cord called central pattern generators or CPGs, and those are involved in rhythmic movements. Anytime we're walking or doing something where we don't have to think about it to do it deliberately, it's just happening reflexively, that central pattern generators and motor neurons. Anytime we're doing something deliberately, that the top-down control, as we call it, from the upper motor neurons comes in and takes control of that system. So it's really simple. You've only got three ingredients. You've got the upper motor neurons, the lower motor neurons, and for rhythmic movements that are reflexive, you've also got the central pattern generator.